energy-related ETFs, diversifying your portfolio in a dynamic sector. The energy sector pulsates with the lifeblood of modern civilization. From powering our homes and industries to fueling transportation and technological advancements, energy resources remain pivotal across the globe. As an investor, navigating this multifaceted sector can be both rewarding and challenging. Enter Exchange Traded Funds, ETFs, potent tools for gaining exposure to diverse energy subsectors without the complexity of picking individual stocks. This article delves into four distinct energy-related ETFs, each tapping into unique corners of the energy landscape. Here. 1. Vanguard Energy Sector ETF, VDE A Broad Brushstroke here. VDE, with its colossal $56 billion in assets under management, AUM, stands as the behemoth of energy ETFs. This passively managed fund tracks the MCSI US Energy 25 40 seconds index, offering investors a broad brushstroke exposure to the energy sector. Its holdings encompass integrated oil and gas giants like ExxonMobil, XOM, and Chevron, CVX, alongside midstream pipeline operators like Kinder Morgan, KMI, and upstream exploration and production companies like ConocoPhillips or COP. By tracking a diverse index, VDE mitigates individual company risk and provides a holistic view of the U.S. energy market. Pros here. 1. Diversification across oil and gas, pipelines, and exploration production. 2. Low expense ratio of 0.04%, minimizing annual fees. 3. High liquidity and tight bid ask spreads, ensuring ease of trading. Cons. 1. Limited exposure to alternative energy sources. 2. Heavy tilt towards large cap companies, potentially missing out on high growth potential of smaller firms. 3. Susceptible to broader market movements affecting the overall energy sector. 2. SPDR SP Oil Gas Equipment Services ETF XES gearing up. While VDE focuses on traditional energy plays, XES zooms in on the essential support systems that keep the machinery humming. This $12 billion ETF tracks the SP Oil Gas Equipment Services Select Industry Index, providing exposure to companies that supply and service the energy sector. Think Schlumberger, SLB, and Halliburton, HAL, offering drilling and well completion services, Baker Hughes, BHI, providing oilfield products and technology, and Caterpillar, CAT, supplying heavy machinery for construction and maintenance. XES offers a unique angle on the energy sector, potentially benefiting from rising drilling activity or increased infrastructure spending. Pros here. 1. Geared towards a high growth segment of the energy sector. 2. Potentially less sensitive to oil price fluctuations compared to pure oil gas plays. 3. Offers diversification within the energy sector, reducing dependence on traditional energy producers. Cons. 1. Higher expense ratio, 0.35% compared to VDE. 2. More volatile than VDE due to its smaller size and focus on smaller cap companies. 3. Susceptible to economic slowdowns that could impact oil and gas exploration and production activities. 3. Invesco Clean Energy ETF, ICLN Embracing the Future. The energy landscape is undergoing a paradigm shift with renewable energy sources like wind and solar rapidly gaining traction. ICLN, with its $16 billion AUM, tracks the Wilder Hill Clean Energy Index, offering investors exposure to companies at the forefront of this clean energy revolution. Holdings include wind and solar energy giants like NextEra Energy, NEE, and First Solar, FSLR, Electric Vehicle, EV, 
manufacturers like Tesla, TSLA, and Li Auto Li, and battery technology companies like Panasonic, PCIFY, and LG Chemistry, LGCY. ICLN provides a pure play on the burgeoning clean energy sector, potentially reaping rewards from the global transition towards cleaner alternatives. Pros here. 1. High growth potential due to the secular trend towards clean energy adoption. 2. Diversification across various clean energy subsectors, mitigating individual company risk. 3. Potentially less susceptible to short term oil price fluctuations. Cons. 1. Higher expense ratio, 0.68%, compared to VDE and XES. 2. Higher volatility due to its exposure to emerging and disruptive technologies. 3. Potentially susceptible to government policies and incentives impacting clean energy adoption. 4. Global X Uranium ETF, UIA a nuclear niche. UIA, with its $3 billion AUM, delves into a niche but potentially crucial energy source, nuclear power. Tracking the Uranium Producers Index, UIA provides exposure to companies engaged in uranium mining, processing, and exploration. The fund's top holdings include Cameco, CCJ, Denison Mines, DNN, and Paladin Energy, PDN. While nuclear power faces public perception challenges, it offers a low-carbon and potentially abundant energy source. Additionally, the recent geopolitical landscape has renewed interest in nuclear energy as a reliable and independent energy source. Pros here. 1. Diversification benefit from exposure to a unique energy subsector with distinct risk-reward dynamics. 2. Potentially attractive risk-adjusted returns due to the limited number of pure-play uranium companies. 3. Potential tailwinds from increased focus on energy security and carbon-free energy sources. Cons. 1. High expense ratio. 0.65%, compared to other ETFs mentioned. 2. Highly volatile due to its niche focus and sensitivity to nuclear related news and events. 3. Subject to regulatory and social concerns surrounding nuclear power and radioactive waste disposal. Choosing the right energy ETF. Each of these four energy ETFs offers distinct advantages and disadvantages, catering to different investment objectives and risk tolerances. VDE provides a broad and low-cost entry point for conservative investors seeking overall energy sector exposure. XES targets a high-growth segment with potential benefits from rising activity, but comes with higher volatility. ICLN capitalizes on the clean energy megatrend, but at the cost of higher fees and inherent volatility. UIA is a niche play on nuclear power, potentially offering significant upside, but also carrying its own set of risks. Ultimately, the choice of the right energy ETF depends on your individual investment goals, risk tolerance, and time horizon. Consider your desired level of diversification exposure to specific energy subsectors, and your appetite for volatility before making a decision. Beyond the big four. While these four ETFs represent prominent players in the energy ETF landscape, it's important to acknowledge the vast array of energy-related options available. Investors seeking specific geographic exposure focus on alternative energy subsectors like hydropower, or geothermal, or thematic plays on energy efficiency, or carbon capture technologies, can find dedicated ETFs catering to their needs. Conclusion here. The energy sector remains a dynamic and ever-evolving landscape, presenting both opportunities and challenges for investors. Energy-related ETFs offer a powerful tool for gaining exposure to this critical sector, 
while mitigating individual company risk and diversifying your portfolio. By carefully assessing your investment goals and risk tolerance, you can choose the energy ETF that aligns with your financial blueprint and potentially reap the rewards of a sector powering the modern world. Thank you.